This week, we're at Lake George Riverview Campground in Lake George, New York. Warrensburg, officially. We're only about four miles away from Lake George, but it's close enough. This park is pretty great. We've been here pretty much for the week already, but we haven't got a chance to get up to the sign yet. So here we are. Let us show you around. It's some pretty great stuff. There's some stuff we don't care for, but all in all, this park's really nice. So just, I'm going to spin around here. This is the road where you come in from across the way here. If you go up that hill, is a price chopper. And right behind me, if you need a, a snack, is a McDonald's. We thought this is going to be a noisy place and you really can't hear road noise from your site. So we're pretty happy about it. Um, we were told to be careful, but uh, I don't know if those people had stayed here before. They just saw the, the road going past and thought it might be a little bit loud, but we're here to tell you it's not. And the price shop is super convenient if you need something. So we are on site 46 at $105 a night. I believe this is the most expensive campsite we've ever stayed on. Pretty close. And the Medina KOA might be a close oh, second. Oh, you're right about that. Yeah. Uh, we've only been here about two hours and we're already ready to go head off to our excursion with Revolution Rail Bike Trail. Um, we're going on the Hadley Run Trail, which takes us on a bridge that goes 500 feet, is 90 feet above water, and we will uh, film these in a separate video, but for now we're just going to give you a little glimpses. Yeah, I'm not going to like this one very much, but I'm doing it for you. I know, with your love of bridges, he's... And heights. <laughs> this yeah. is the, the worst thing that could possibly happen, but it looks like a lot of fun. It's the coolest trail. He has to suck it up. <laughs> yep. So, uh, yeah, there's so much to do in this area. I mean, the campground's nice from so far. We got a nice breeze. We're in the shade. Awesome. There's a lot of seasonal sites that are not so and we're on a full hookup site right on the waterfront so we got a deluxe site because we're going to be here for seven days right. so it was what 765 dollars for seven days oh yeah about, about roughly there, something like that close we'll, we'll put a comment or something <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we also want to go to white base mountain we want lake to placid lake placid yes we want to go to uh high falls gorge we right want, um, we could hit up all sable maybe again yeah maybe since uh morgan's here she has not seen that and it's definitely worth the Going to, yeah. To, yeah, yeah to take her to yeah so it's gonna be a fun trip watch for all the side videos and uh we'll see you up yeah. there this is site 45 right next door to us our friends jim and michelle are going to be staying on this one later um, again, overlooking the Sharoon River, uh, water, electric, cable, sewer, wonderful. So this is site 51. Sites 50 through 55 are all pull-through sites. There's an arcade. Plenty to do for the kids. There's a swimming pool with a three-foot end and then higher to a five-foot end. It's swim at your own risk, though. And right next to the pool is a shower house with four individual stalls with shower, toilet, sink to get ready to go swimming. Over the course of this week, we've gone to Stone Bridges and Caves. We're going to show snippets of everything along the way, but we do have separate videos on most of what we've done. As long as there was something you know, substantial to, to film, we filmed it. So right. stay tuned for all those videos. We went to Kuhis Falls. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Hey, Cohoes uh, Falls. It's C-O-H-O-E-S. Yeah. Cohoes. Um, what else did we do? We did a lot this week. We went to, what was the other mountain we went up to? Ah, Prospect Mountain. Prospect Mountain. Drove to the top of that. We didn't film as much on that one. No, that was definitely not as good as Whiteface. We did them. No. White face than prospect, and you shouldn't. If you're gonna do both of them, do prospect first because white face just blows them all away. Yeah. Uh, oh, we went to Saratoga Springs, Saratoga yes. Spa, the see the geysers. Yeah, we're gonna have a film for that. We did the hike with Roberta. Oh, shelving rock falls. Yep, shelving rock falls. But really, this park has has a great location central to just about everything. I don't think we've driven much more than an hour everywhere we've wanted to go. Yeah. Uh, all around the Adirondacks and down into Saratoga Springs and such. So uh, it's, it's been pretty great. And I think of other things, but 
I don't know. They'll come to us. Hmm. We'll throw them on up here. Go like, oh, yeah, we also did this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks, we're going to get out of the water. See you soon. This is site L11, which is kind of on a corner. Here's the bathhouse. Caution when wet. Okay. Anyway, this is what I want to see. This is the bathhouse. It's really neat looking. The bathhouse has four shower stalls. It's got the shower and the bathroom. It's really nice. This is site 19, and if we were on a shorter stay, we'd choose this because it's treed, there's water in the back, it's water, electric, and cable, no sewer. We chose to have a sewer site because we're going to be here for a whole week. And there's 14, 13, 12, 11, this whole row of them that back right up to the river. This is M20, and it's a back end site. Oh, I'm sorry, it's M21, which is a back end site that kind of goes uphill. I don't, I don't know, I don't think I'd like this. We call this the parking lot. Everybody's kind of out in the open, but this is the perfect place for these really big rigs, because uh, there's a lot of money in rigs right here. No dogs on this beach, but it's fairly large for a private campground. Got a nice swimming area, nice calm water to swim in. Here we've got sites N, 34, 35, and 36. These are all the way at the outside. These are back ends. These are all full hookups. We've got water, electric, and cable. Actually, they're, oh, they're sewer. Okay, so we got it. Uh, it does back up to the Shroon River here. You're not gonna launch a kayak out of this. But we got some good views out back. Oops, got a bug in my hair. No ducks over here. Yeah, get away from me, bugs. Pretty. So we got N27, 28, 29, 30, and 31 over here. These are water, electric, and cable, no sewer. I did check that out first before I started talking. And again, these back right up to the Shroon River quite pretty. Again, you're not going to launch anything out of here, but you got some great views of the river. No ducks here either. So right from our site, we're going to launch. Our fire pit's right overlooking the water. It's a great site. We're on site 46. Uh, planning on going out and splashing in the water. First, the kayak's got to come off the truck. Okay, they're down. Now to get them into the water. You came. Oh my God. <laughs> Should we put this in the what not to do? Uh, don't do this at home. Eh? Don't do this at home. <laughs>